Creepy, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Shrieking skull will shock your souls. Hey guys, it's Nick from us here, and today I'm going to be bringing you a Mortal Kombat 11 topic video that I've been wanting to talk about for quite some time now on my channel, which would be new ninjas. We all love them, come on, Scorpion, Sub-Zero, Ermac, Reptile, the list goes on to even newer ninjas such as Scarlet and Tremor. Because of those two ninjas, Scarlet and Tremor, I believe we'll get a new ninja in the next Mortal Kombat game, which I believe Mortal Kombat 11, I don't know what they're going to call it. We don't know exactly that the game's been announced or anything, but I mean, come on, we all know it's happening and it's in the works. We'll get Mortal Kombat 11. Point is, I think that we're going to be getting some sort of a new ninja because, I mean, like, really, they made a ninja out of, like, Scarlet. And Tremor's one thing, like, Earth, Rock, Powers, you hear about that, that's doable. Blood powers? Now that's something I don't hear about a whole lot, and I thought Scarlet personally was really cool. I thought she had a really diverse moveset, and I think she could have a really cool lore in the Mortal Kombat, like, you know, series. So what I'm hoping for what they do, is if they don't bring back Tremor or Scarlet, which I would like probably the most, uh, like, I think they should include Tremor and Scarlet in the story mode, and have some lore on them, and actually bring them into the Mortal Kombat world, not just... You know, the DLC thing was nice, but it would be really nice to get them a part of the game now that they are real characters. But, on the other hand, look at like what I was saying, they can make a ninja out of blood, there's still plenty of ideas they could work with. We all know the idea about Chrome, I've done a video on Chrome, I know a lot of people feel a certain way about Chrome, but I mean, metal bending powers to me is a really cool idea, and I think it could fit in the Mortal Kombat world. I just think the fatalities of all things would be very gruesome. Um, I mean, even Ed Boon has admitted something about Chrome in an interview, I believe, or a podcast, or some sort of live stream, something. I can't exactly cite it, but I do remember somebody asking him the possibility of Chrome ever being in a Mortal Kombat game, and I think his answer was something along the lines of, like, well, he's a fan character, so I don't really know if we could use him. However, they could still use the concept, because, I mean, there's nothing saying that it has. they have to name it Chrome and he has to look like the design that fans have been giving this Chrome character. I think they could just make a silver ninja or whatever, not smoke obviously, but make him have mental bending powers. And if we're not going to go with the idea of Chrome, I mean there's always other ideas like, for example, look how well NetherRealm Studios managed to create plant characters like for instance Poison Ivy and Swamp Thing in the Injustice games. They perfected them, like all of their super moves were awesome and it proves that they can use that kind of element. I think they should make a plant based ninja. I've seen fan art of it again. They have plenty of ideas to make up new ninjas and I would really like it if the new ninjas were actually a part of the story and not just DLC like they have been in the past. Now, my last and favorite idea for a possible new ninja in the Mortal Kombat game would be to take a character that they already have existing and turn him into even more of a badass ninja than they already had him as. And by that character, I mean Takeda. Now, we all know he was Scorpion's apprentice in Mortal Kombat X and in the comics. So yeah, he basically is a ninja already, but I'm talking about a traditional ninja, like, you know, give him his own color, give him his own thing, make him look like Scorpion and Sub-Zero, but I think instead of giving Takeda an element, they could just stick with the whips and whatever, and they could stick to like a traditional ninja where he's like really badass, and he's all about his fighting techniques more so than an element. And I think that could really place well in a Mortal Kombat game as well. Anyway, just a couple of quick ideas. I'm very excited for the announced date of Mortal Kombat 11. Whenever that will be, I am sitting here waiting for it. Let me know what video I should do next in the comments below. As always, it's been Nick Famous. See you later. Let's see how he likes a Kamehameha!